everyone. So I am 22 weeks and 5 days today. I'll be 23 weeks on Saturday, which I find a little bit funny because I actually turn 23 tomorrow, um, age-wise, so <laughs> I found that kind of ironic. The same thing happened with Lex. Um, I think I turned 21 and I was two days away from being 21 weeks, so that's pretty funny. Um, but anyway, craving-wise, I've been kind of craving anything and everything kind of random. Um, the other day I was craving green olives, and then another day I was craving roasted red peppers, which I don't normally eat. Um, I'm not a red pepper kind of person. Um, don't get me wrong, they're good, but I don't eat them all the time, and I, they're not my go-to vegetable. Um, and then for the past few days, I've actually been craving anything citrus, so like oranges, um, pineapple, which I know isn't technically a citrus fruit, but it's tangy and it's really good, and oranges, so anything citrus. Um, lemons, limes, love them. Um, I can't think of any other cravings, but uh, symptom-wise, my whole body is sore. Like, I get out of bed, I'm super sore, and it's not that our bed is uncomfortable. Our bed is super comfortable. It's just every joint in my body is just so sore that... The slightest movement getting out of bed hurts um, my tailbone especially so like moving over to get off the bed really sucks but oh well um, I am actually gonna get a prenatal massage next month which I'm super excited about but they didn't have any openings this month so <laughs> I kind of have to wait until next month and Another symptom, I guess, is I've been leaking a lot more. Um, not technically a lot, but it's been leaking more often. So, finally had to start wearing the nursing pads, and I have the, the washable, reusable ones. So, it's not as bad, I guess. But, yeah, um, we're starting to get everything kind of figured out that we're going to need for the baby, which technically isn't a lot because we didn't find that we needed a lot with Lex, but we have clothes figured out for the first three months, um, and like I said, they're gender neutral, so whether we have a boy or a girl, it doesn't really matter. Lex wore gender neutral slash boy clothes for the first, like, six months of her life, so it's not really that big of a deal for us. Um... I do plan on doing a gender reveal on here, but I am probably going to wait until um, all of our family knows, so probably like Wednesday or Thursday or just the next pregnancy vlog. We actually find out on Monday, which super excited. It's only four days away. Um, my husband will argue and say five because he counts the day that you're currently on, but I don't, so four days? five days, however you count it, um, but yeah, so I find out then, he's not able to come with me, so it's either I find out first, and then he's gonna call me, or I'm gonna wait and not find out until he finds out, and just have my doctor write it down, or do something cute like that, I don't know, but he said he doesn't mind if I know first, but I know if I find out first, I'm gonna wanna go buy something, and... <laughs> I'd rather not, so, yeah. Um, anything else that I can think of? Not really, so. Pretty short update. Um, I'll show you guys my belly. Ooh, actually, I can't think of something else. This baby is, like, super, super strong, and I posted a video yesterday of the baby moving, and seriously, like, I didn't get this kind of movement with Lex until 30 plus weeks but this one it's already you can notice like body parts moving you can notice um like 
kicking constantly, I can already feel hiccups, um, just everything like that, like, they're so strong. And somebody commented on that video saying that <laughs> this baby's gonna be like the Hulk coming out, and that scares me, like, there's still 17 weeks left, or, like, 14 to 17 weeks, depending on when they decide to come. Um, hopefully a little bit later than 36 weeks, like, with Lex, but either way it doesn't really matter, but seriously, there's this much, I mean, there's still quite a bit left, and I can't imagine them getting stronger, or, I don't know, they might bust out, or I don't know what's gonna happen, but <laughs> it makes me a little bit scared, um, since you can already see, like, body parts come pretty far out of my stomach but yeah um I think that's it <laughs> so I'll go ahead and show you guys my belly and I will talk to you guys next week oh I'm wearing hello kitty <laughs> so you probably won't be able to see this very well but And I don't have any of the uh, Linea Negra from Lex showing anymore. I think that went away like <coughs> 14 months for her, but yeah, so I don't have it yet and I'm pretty excited about that because it got pretty dark. But anyway, I will talk to you guys next week. Bye.